hopefully this will be the exciting conclusion of the game. Don't worry, you didn't miss anything. Come on, Arthur really need a hundred dollars? So, apparently I still need a light purple property, even though... And so basically, well, as you see, or you can just watch the first part, you know what happens so far. So Arthur wants boardwalk, the answer is no deal, unbelievable. I then on the text. I need the money. Well, I get to visit Arthur in jail. Really? He gets out free. Well, he has to pay me $14, but okay, obviously, you know, I'd like to pay the $50 first, you know. Let's see, eight good, good item waterworks. So Arthur, unfortunately, owns that property. Let's see, three. Look at that, $12, courtesy of the waterworks. Still, a chance for a third of an offer. Oh, right, let's see. It's on Mortgage Pacific Avenue. What's left? And, ooh, Illinois. Probably should have done Mediterranean. But why would I do Mediterranean? Let's see. Two dollars. Go to jail. Can't be going to jail. Okay. Wonder. So I clearly picked the wrong property to un Unless, of course, it doubles and Arthur pays it off somehow. First roll is an A. Let's see, we got a six, so he'll need five dollars. He got a seven. He has to pay the hospital one hundred dollars, unfortunately. So let's move on to C. I guess I'll do St. James Place. Phew, I don't know that railroad. Pay poor tax. I can't be doing that. Why wow, I can't be giving Arthur $18? Look at that. Two dollars. Thank you very much. Alright, then on boardwalk. I could have got 50, but it's okay. Arthur gets some money. And this is a Charles place. That is not good. Look at that. Looks like Arthur did my work for him. But no way, he can't. I have to reject his deal. I don't have enough money to make the trade. So let's mortgage walk to make the trade for say Charles place. Two hundred thirty-nine dollars for it. This is good. So I finally own the purple property I was looking for. That's definitely, I definitely would like to keep the, the green and light blue properties on the mortgage. That makes sense to do that. I get the most money. Fifty-two and fifty-six. Come on, fifty dollars. So, Saint James and Mediterranean come back. So one more property go boardwalk. That helps the cause. Fifty two dollars. Up to one twenty five. Avoid boardwalk. Advance to go. Good. Not advance to boardwalk. I would like to go to boardwalk. Well, see what happens when you take my money and I get the property? You eventually, if you land on it, you have to give it to me. You have to give me the money. So there's still, ooh, there's two properties still out there. One is Baltic Avenue, the other is States Avenue. So it doesn't matter who gets States Avenue. Unless I trade for Virginia Avenue, then it would matter. 
And it does matter who gets ball tick. Because I can get five. Thirty-five dollars. Finally, that's good. But alright, there we go. I've unmortgaged all the properties for now. I have twenty-four dollars, so there's no guarantee that I have to keep those properties mortgaged. So, I have to like tr to trade. He would like boardwalk. Now it makes sense, it's unmortgaged. So, of course, the answer is no deal. Pay Arthur $50. Ridiculous. So, unfortunately, I have to mortgage Meta Train them because of that $50 expense. See? Pretty much. Good, $25. I can use $25. And here's utility. Oh, come on. In the $900. Can't believe I got the nearest utility card in my life. There we go. Alright, now, hopefully I'll be able to build houses on the blue property. Look at that. $56. Unbelievable. Okay, so there's two out of the $50 needed. Okay, let's see. Second roll, he gets an 11. So he'll need a three or doubles to pay it off. The jail fee. He got a seven. So we gave you two out of the $50. Let's see. So I've lost $48. So what will happen with this community chess card? $10. Okay. So basically, lost $38. Well, I was in jail. But Arthur was kind enough to give me 18 and then 28. Oh, nothing wrong with me getting $28. So I guess I will start building houses on the light blue property. So Arthur would like waterworks. The answer is Romeo. Can't be giving him well, give him sixty-six dollars that turn. Thank you, I get fifty-two of it right back. So, okay, hop on over. $150. Now I'd want him to go to Boardwalk because I get $50 at least. Let's see. No, that's not good. Good thing I didn't take a chance on Oriental Avenue. Oh, well, I will now. Good. Let's spend $150 putting houses here. So I believe it's $30 and $40 if he lands on it. Fifty dollars to Arthur. How is that helpful? Good. Don't land in it now that it has thirty and forty. I'd like to land in it when it's five hundred five hundred fifty and six hundred dollars. There we go. I will buy State Avenue. So if there's one more property left to be sold. It is Ball to get for me. So we got double, so I can't take a chance. Well, he would have avoided it anyway. So, Arthur would like to trade. Let's see, he would like Boardwalk. All right, let's get back to the game. Let's see, I got a six, okay, 66. Give him $16 off the jail fee. All right, I would like to get a five next turn, but oh, we get to keep that money. He had a get out of jail card. That's ridiculous. That's not ridiculous. It's part of the game. Ten. Let's see. Take a walk on the boardwalk. Well, I move up three spaces. Five. On. Come on. I can't let on income tax. 
I needed that gold money to put money on houses. Alright, let's take a chance. Let's put a house on Connecticut Avenue. Now, this could easily be a mistake, but he's on Reading Railroad, so... What a surprise he missed it by one. He needed a four, he got a five instead. Even a three would have been bad. That would have made that would have meant that I put the house in the wrong place. No. Okay, he owns Fed Terrain. And again, he would like to trade. So he would like waterworks. And the answer is no deal. Seven? Oh, come on. Let's mortgage meta trade avenue. Let's see, he gets a nine. Go back three spaces. He gets twenty dollars. Five. Come on. Let's see, ten. What a surprise. Arthur got ball to the avenue. Alright, let's see. Second roll. Twelve. He paid off the jail fee. It'd be nice to have, you know, a little more just in case, you know, I lose money. Roll nine. So let's see. Fifty dollars. Would you get to keep? Nothing wrong with keeping fifty dollars. Let's see. He owns one. Guys, that's okay. Six, fifty dollars. Thank you. Perfect. So we're up to 110. Good thing I didn't put houses there. Two these. Could have put one. Spent fifty dollars. Oh, let's see, got me. He is there, so I guess I'll put it on Oriental Avenue. Then I'll get the second house. He got a seven, so he owns reading it. Right? So I clearly put the house on the wrong property. Alright, let's put two houses here. Why did I put it on Oriental Avenue by mistake? I wanted to put it on Connecticut. But it's fine. There was no chance he was going to land on Oriental that turn. So, Arthur would like Boardwalk again. Of course, the answer is no deal. Good, land on these railroads that I am. Don't go to jail, that doesn't help. Let's see, good, good, night. He, he owns that property over on New York. Alright, it's Arthur's first turn pay off my jail fee. Second, okay, $14 off the jail fee, so. But he would need a 12. And then, of course, you get to roll again. You know, 40, you give me $62. So $14 off the jail fee. You would need doubles or... Well, he got a 12. Why? Well, didn't expect him to pay off the jail fee. $62 so far. But he got a 12, so that's automatically doubles. He got a 9. Let's see. Look, get that. $12 in jail. He is heading. Oh no, why am why is it going right to that? Let's put how let's put take a chance, but two houses here, so they all have three. He doesn't I want him to land on the property. He just got out of jail. For his first roll, he gave me nothing. He needs three to pay off the jail. He said he got a five. Oh come on, this is ridiculous. So I'll just I'll just do it right to get you. So Arthur would like to trade. Let's see. He would like Atlantic Avenue. It's mortgaged, but it's okay. The answer is no deal. Can't wait to mortgage that property. 
but that's helpful. Forty-four dollars. It's very because I had to give him fifty, so we have to add fifty. I actually did you know, add that forty-four dollars because I mortgaged that property. Doctor's fee. Now it's fifty dollars lower than I expected. He's right at the monopoly. He actually went. Wow! I just went to jail. Finally, Arthur paid off the jail fee. And then some. $270. That's good. Oh, look, 280 Which I get to keep it all. Arthur was kind of... Actually, no, I have to unmortgage Atlantic Avenue first. And Mediterranean. There. That was good. 270 Got It made me unmortgage all my properties. Plus, he has one, two, three, four. He has five trade outlets. That was good. I'm glad he got assessed. And he gets a five. Six would have been better. Twenty-four, Arthur. Okay, Arthur. What would you like this time? Well, he is making a lot of trades. I may have to trade for a few properties, you know, to reduce these trade outlets. Because he clearly wants to keep trading. Good, 319. Fee. That's good. Nine. $45. So, let's put the remaining three houses here. Increasing damage. Let's see. Really? It's got doubles. Okay, he owns Virginia Avenue. Bank pays you fifty dollars. We'll get that. Another fourteen dollars. So Arthur got to live at once when it was two seventy and three hundred. Hopefully the next time we'll end it will be worth you know five fifty and six hundred. That helps. Fifty two dollars. Good, another 50. That's helpful. You can't be giving me this money. So again, Arthur would like to trade again. So he would like St. James Place. The answer is no deal. Double real. Good. All right, so at least I gained $100. I have to give Arthur 100 as well. But at least because of that money, I can put hotels here. Now I can start putting houses on the green property. Look at that. Two dollars. Two is basically the absolute minimum you can get from someone. You can't get one dollar. You can't say, oh, I'll give you one dollar. Maybe if you trade, but not reward. Ten dollars. That's okay. Another fourteen. Nothing wrong with that. Oh, actually, if you land on Connecticut Avenue, I can use that money to put more houses on you know, the green property. They each get a house. Good. There's a nice green $20 house. So let's put a house on North Carolina Avenue. I'll spend $200 on that. I'm obviously not going to sell some hotels. I don't want to do that. Let's see. One. He got a six. Wow, he actually landed on the house. that The property that I gave a house. $130. Alright, he's probably not going to land on Pennsylvania Avenue, but he could. There's a chance. Wow, he got doubles. A six and a six. Maybe, I don't know, now he got a one-on-one. -on -one. 
Hmm, but he got a nine instead. Ten dollars, please. Good, two hundred dollars from go. All right, you can take Indian. You are right there, so Pacific Avenue will get a house. Two take a chance. They all have one house. It's no longer 52 and 56. It's 130 and 150. I wanted to land on a property that I own. So, if I would like Meta Train and Avenue. Of course, the answer is no deal. Few, but he needs two, three, or five, and he got 12 instead. He has to give me two dollars, so. He got a. Really, he got a six land in that chance card. At least he gave me twenty dollars, so. Hopefully that'll get me around the board. Fifty dollar expense on BL Railroad. But Arthur took care of that. One hundred thirty dollars. Keep landing on North Carolina Avenue. Look at the two dollars. He is at the Monopoly. Look at that. Six hundred dollars. I can't be giving me six hundred dollars. So let's buy more houses here. I got 600 from Arthur. Now, the green property of two houses. Now it's 390 and 450. Let's see, he got a second. All right, make your trade offer. Again. What is that? He would like waterworks. The answer is no deal. Come on, I am my income tax. How was that helpful? Look at that. $32. Hey, good thing it was not go back three spaces. Because that would have been horrible. I would have got the income tax twice. Let's see. Will he land on my blue property again? He can't. Obviously, before it was then. That would be my green property would get even stronger. Well, he avoided it. Good, good. He can take New York Avenue. I'll give him fifty dollars. Well, I do have to wonder if I have to make a trade for a railroad. Hopefully, I won't have to. So, Arthur would like Meta Train Avenue. Of course, the answer is no deal. And then it's the St. Charles place. Alright, let's take a chance. I'll put it on Pennsylvania Avenue. That's the final, not the final, the third house. He got a nine instead. Advance to go. He only moves up four spaces, so he avoided my green monopoly. That is not good. You can't be giving me $600 under any circumstances. If that means the green gets three houses every time you land on Connecticut Avenue. I guess now it's only going to get two houses because that's the max I can put. It, it had, you know, few. And, uh, both had two. And one at three, now one is four, and the other have three. Oh, oh should I have taken a chance? I'll put a house on North Carolina Avenue, so that will have four houses. Look at that, it paid off $1,100. So, Arthur would like to trade. Let's see, he would like Waterworks. Of course, the answer is no deal. 
house. Let's put the final house on Pacific Avenue. There's been 800 out of that 1,100 I just got to put hotels on the green property. Let's see. What, should I reduce these trade outlets? Let's see. We've got advance to go. I moved up seven spots. So obviously that wouldn't have eliminated heading out of one by one. But it would not have been. It would have been the mortgage a lot of properties. I'm obviously going to pay $200. That does not make any sense to me. I pay 10%. Because it's much more than $200. Come on, that's the third time I've been the double railroad card. Usually, you know, I'm pretty good at avoiding that, but obviously not today. Let's see. 128. He would need... I think Pennsylvania Avenue would eliminate him. Maybe even Pacific Avenue. Let's see. Oh, good. Four dollars. Come on. So I'm obviously not going to make the same mistake I did yesterday. I will get out of jail because he could be eliminated. Nine. There we go. That is the game. So I didn't have to make any more trades to eliminate trail. Let's Arthur just land on the green property. So I will see you in the next video.